Hi, my tribe of men. Welcome to the 33 Men's Voice podcast here on Black News and Media. With me, Kwabna Bibini Belma, you can call me DJ for the public enemy who has no one. Today, we are about to do a quick one, a quick one on one of the newest relationships come for men. But most importantly, this scam, its victims are weak men and simps. Okay, so the new relationship scam is none other than I don't need a man. I don't need a man. It sounds so harmless, but this simple statement is making a lot of weak men a victim. So we are going to go into that. When you hear this modern feminist woman say, I don't need a man. This is supposed to be a simple statement. Yeah, they don't need a man, so you let them go. I think I've done a video on that, but I, after thinking about it, going through it, I realized that I need to do this one for men. And most importantly, if you're a man and you know you're weak, and sometimes nobody wants to accept that they're weak. So maybe after I give all the uh, uh, backgrounds, the explanations, the interpretation, then you may know that you fall right into this. So let's get into it. How this new statement has become the newest relationships come for weak men and how it happens. So these days, one of the commonest things that you hear from feminists on social media, TikTok in particular, YouTube, Facebook and everywhere, is I don't need a man. And one thing that we should know is that women take advantage of psychology, especially reverse psychology, than anything else. So therefore, when you hear a woman saying, I don't need a man, these women know what they are talking about. I mostly check the age range. You hardly find an 18 year old, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, up to 25 year old saying they don't need men. The age range from which you hear this come going on is from 27, 28, 29. And sometimes most of you don't even hear that 27, 28, 29 saying it, but from 30 upwards, mid 30 or early 30, mid 30, 40s, 50s, and sisters, this is where you hear the scam going on a lot. Okay? And a lot of weak men are falling for this scam, which shouldn't be the case. In reality, this shouldn't be the case. Men are supposed to leave these women alone. But because of reverse psychology, most men fall for this. Most men do not know what to do with this. They go into relationship with this. I don't need a man, woman, and then they begin to cry. And a lot of men call me, and by the time you analyze their issue, they fell for some of this. I don't need a man, woman. And why is I don't need a man the newest scam? Ladies and gentlemen, Yes, I don't need a man is the newest relationships come. Why? Because instead of men to really take this woman serious when they say they don't need men and do not force themselves to have a relationship with this man, most weak men rather force themselves to have a relationship with this man, woman. Any serious, strong-minded alpha male high-valued man who know himself will never force himself into a relationship with any woman that has ever said even once that they don't need men. But unfortunately, the weak men are more than the strong men. So the weak men fall for them. The weak man is a man who sometimes find it difficult approaching women, find it difficult talking to women, find it difficult even breaking a common ice with women. In short, these men have scarcity mindset 
about women. Okay? Or around women. So it's difficult for them to get female attention, relationships, and most importantly, sex. Okay? So who are these I don't need a man, women? They are mostly feminists who use their younger age when they could have gotten the men they want to hoe around, sleep around with men, random men, in casual style. And then all of a sudden, they enter their 30s, go into their 40s and 50s sometimes, and they realize that, look, <laughs> now I need a man so badly, but I do not have what a man wants for me. Once I get the man, what the man needs for me, I do not have it. And what do I do? Before I go back, I go on to what they do. Let me also bring into the equation another group of women who begin to sing, I don't need a man. This group or this second group of women, they did not, they did, majority of them did not hoe around. They got married pretty young, maybe 22, 23, 24, 25. 26, 27, 28, maybe 30, they got married. But after marrying for about 10 years, 15 years, this second group of men, a woman, begin to listen to feminists and say that why should you get married so young and all of that? You give all your, your, your prime age to a man. And this group of women fall for this feminist agenda. And by all means necessary, they file for divorce, get divorced from their husbands. Without the husband maltreating them, insulting them, beating them, doing anything bad, they file for divorce. Especially in Western countries where you can file for divorce based on no fault claims. So now we have two groups of women who do not have men. And this second group of women that I described, very soon... If they, they realized that the, the grass is not greener as they, they thought or saw when they were married. So they go into the dating market and they realize that nobody is looking for a woman that has been married with kids and single now. So they also become desperate and angry on the dating market. And what is the best strategy for this woman to get men without a sweat? For these women to get men with that sweat, they resort to, I don't need a man, psycholo reverse psychological uh, message. So nobody has asked them, they want them, but uh, for some reasons, they switch on their camera, they go on TikTok in particular, and they start ranting. Men are this, men are da 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 And uh, I went on a date, and this guy did this to me, and... You can go to TikTok and you, 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 you bear me witness. And because of that, I don't need a man. And hey, let's give them their due. Most of these women, they look pretty uh, beautiful and attractive. So they're saying they don't need a man. A man like me, who is a, a highly initiated man like me, I would not fall for them. But majority of men who are weak, majority of men who are tasty for sex, majority of men who are tasty for female attention will fall for this woman. So the men who find it difficult getting um, women begin to go into their DMs, their uh, uh, comment section, and begin to pamper them, console them. Oh, what did, what, what happened? And probably they know that a man did something to them because this woman will narrate a story of a man doing something to them. Okay? And this woman say they don't need men. After going on a couple of dates, the things men are asking of them, the things men are demanding from them, they realize that they do not qualify. They don't qualify for a man. But they still need a man to save them because at that time, they cannot, the adrenaline uh, feminism gave to them that, oh, they are going to get men at their back and call. Or they, once they have jobs and career and money, they can, they can live even without men or 
whatever they tell them, they get to know that at this age, working till they die, they can't. They need a man to save them. But what they will give back to a man when that man comes to save them, they don't have. Or even if they have feminism tells them they are too precious, they don't give anything to men. So they say, I don't need a man. Mm -hmm. They say, I don't need a man in order to trap weak men. And this weak men begin to think, oh, what has, what has come over men? And this weak men, they are the ones that you see them on lives, TikTok lives and all of that, bashing their colleague men without knowing what these women have done. What has come over, over these wicked men? How can you treat a man, a woman like this? So this weak man think that if he can convince this man, woman with no value for to a man to start a relationship with him, yeah, he has done something. He has felt for the first time won a war in his life. And his life means something to him. Okay, so this woman, this man approached this uh, woman and they start talking to them about love or relationship. And this woman will start playing hard to get. They had to get their play. It's not because they have something valuable they're protecting. They have nothing. They are valueless on the dating market. But the more they play hard to get, the more they become valuable in the minds and the eyes of these weak men. And these weak men keep doing everything these women ask them to do in order to start a relationship with them. And finally, they win them over. And this man, over time, realized that these women are empty. They have nothing to offer them. But it is too late at this time. So every day, this woman will bring up something that this man is supposed to do before they give them something little like a sex. So they will deny this man sex for three months and give them sex for one week or just three days in a week. And this weak man feels so fine. But over time, they realize that this relationship is too one way. It's one-sided. Okay? So once again, why is it a scam? The new scam. The moment you hear a woman say, I don't need a man. What? It's a coded language. The code, when you decode it, what they are saying is that, yes, all men around, if you see me, go. Don't come my way because I do not qualify for a man. I do not deserve a man. Why? Everything a man needs from a woman, I do not have it. I have thrown it away, those that I had naturally. I have destroyed it. It has depleted in me. Those that I need to learn to have, acquire, and give to a man, I did not learn. From my 16 years up to 30, I did not learn any of them. I was casually dating, moving from man to man, so I did not have them. And even if I want to learn, I can't. Okay? So, seriously, I do not need a man. But, thanks to reverse psychology and dark psychology, thanks to narcissism, every human being knows that most of the most expensive things is difficult to come by. So, the moment a woman who naturally needs somebody, a human being in their life, especially a man, especially when they are growing, to say they don't need a man, Hmm. There are real men who have built themselves. The initiated men will know that this woman is not saying she doesn't need a man. This woman is saying that she does not qualify to have a man in her life. She does not deserve to have a man in her life. But the initiated men are not many. The uninitiated men, the simps, the weak men are many. They are the ones that will fall for this scam. Therefore, let me say, I don't need a man. And this weak man, tasty for sex, tasty for female companionship, will be shaken. Like men, people, human beings on Turkey. And they will come rushing for me. So let me do it. 
So ladies and gentlemen, this is the newest scam coming from the camp of feminist women. Women with no value. So when you hear them say, I don't need a man, understand them. What they mean is that they don't deserve a man. They don't qualify for a man. Why? Whatever a man demands from them, they do not have it. That is why they say, I don't need a man. I decided to keep this video so short because this is a scam that is um, swallowing a lot of weak men. So please, if you've been able to watch to this far, kindly do well to share this video. The most important thing that I want you to do on this video is to share it on your WhatsApp group, share it to individuals, brothers that you know are suffering from being weak and sims, share this video to them. And please do well to subscribe and not just subscribing, give us your comment and like the videos. And if you have any video that you want us to react to or you have anything that you want us to do a video on, send us an email on blacknificentmedia at gmail.com and uh, we'll respond to you as such. Thank you for watching. Once again, this is the 33 Men's Voice podcast.